Now we're going to go for the guard pass. This time, I'm inside the guard. I want to keep my knees not too much spread apart. I want to control his hips with my legs. I want to keep my back upright. Pressure on his chest, keep him, his upper body down. My left hand control his pants so I can keep his hips on the ground. As I do that, I'm going to move my both knees back slightly without leaning forward. My right knee is going to go on his tailbone, and my left leg I'm going to turn just like this. I push his leg down with my left elbow, put my left elbow inside my ribs so he doesn't pull my arm inside. My right hand goes under his leg, keep my head up, shake his leg on my neck, and reach for his lapel. As I reach for his lapel, I put my weight forward with my head up, both knees off the ground, my weight on his hips, my left hand, I push his knee down, this way. with my left hand from his, his pants over here, I reach his knee, and now I just walk with my legs and hips at the same time. Put my weight on top of his chest, reach his lapel, his belt, I'm sorry, his belt, his hips, and finish the side. Now we're going to go for the pass guard from inside over the leg. Keep a good posture. Keep your head up. Keep your back up. Control his upper body with the right hand. Push his chest down. My left hand, control his hips, holding the pants. You can hold the belt, but sometimes the belt moves around. I'm going to break the guard like we did before. Move my both knees back a little bit, my knee on his tailbone. I don't lean forward in any moment. Now, I hope up my hips like a clock position. Push his leg down with my left elbow. My right hand goes under his leg. Shake his leg on your neck. Keep your head up, not down. Head up. Reach his lapel. Low. Touch your fist on the ground. Put the weight forward and down on his hips. Left hand goes on his knee. Now, I try to pass to my right, but he blocks my hips with his hands. So instead I go to my right, I go to my left. I put my left knee between my arm and his hips on the floor. As I do that, my right foot cover his leg. You can see my right foot block his leg also. I reach his lapel with my left hand. When I do that, I flip my hips, okay, in this position. Drop my weight on his chest and finish in his side. Another pass the guard now from a standing position. What I'm looking for in this position to keep my good posture one more time, control his upper body. Left hand on his hips. First leg is going to go up is my right leg, not my left. With my right arm forward, right left up first. I still upright, I don't lean forward. Okay? Head up, left leg. Now I pull his body underneath my body and stand up. My right hand was far forward. I pull up first. Push his knee and his hips down. Break the guard. I step back with my right leg, right arm under, and duck my left elbow in. Reach his lapel. Same time. I step back with my left leg and push his knee down with my left hand like we need to pass the guard number one. Now he's going to turn. And we finish the same way we did before. Control his knee, control his upper body, 
Con todos los hips with your body. Walk. And let the leg escape. Side. And hold his belt. Another pass from standing. Pass number two from standing position. Same as before, basic grip. Both lapels, control his upper body. Left hand control his hips. If my right arm is forward, my right leg goes up first. One, two. I pull his body underneath my body. Get up. Break the guard. But from this time, I'm going to go back to both legs and pull his leg down with my left elbow. My knee is going to go on top of his leg, same time my left hand push his knee down. When I get this position, I put my left elbow on his left side, trap his leg, turn, and finish on top of the chest. Another pass the guard called Passage in Toriando. My partner on his back this time. His guard is open. I already break this guard. What I'm going to do, I'm going to stand up after I break his guard. Okay, he closed guard. I break his guard. Grab his knee. Grab his knee, both hands. And get up. I keep his both knees closed together. Not spread apart. When I do that, what I'm going to do in this position, I just can step forward with my left foot. But before I do that, I have to fake. I fake, I'm going to my right, okay? And I shift my body to the other side. I fake, go to the other side. My knee goes on the floor. Be careful to the knee apart on the ribs. Knee on the floor. When I do that, rotate my hips, land on the chest. Hold his belt, hold his hips. I can stop this position or just go for the regular side mount. 